Hello, 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 my friends, Caitlin here, and it is time to do a little bit of Christmas DIY. So I was thinking about doing a Christmas lookbook because I've collected quite a few Christmas sweaters and Christmas outfits over the past few years, but I was inspired by a post I saw on Facebook where someone had made their own ugly Christmas sweater with their faces of their cats on it. And I was like, wait a second, this is by far a better Christmas video. <laughs> Let's, let's get to it. What you'll need to make a crazy cat lady Christmas sweater. Photos of your cat or cats, of course. An assortment of 100% cotton shirts or sweatshirts. Some iron-on sheets that you can buy from your local craft store or Amazon. You'll also need a hard surface like a wooden table, a pillowcase, and an iron. For your decorations, you can get an assortment of felt, pom-poms, fabric glue, and fabric paint. So first we headed over to Photoshop. Once you've got everything together, then get to printing. I guess I guess it should also be noted that you need an inkjet printer in order to print on the iron-iron sheets. It's not just magic. Next, you cut out the iron-iron pieces, making sure to leave a little tab on the end so that you can peel off the ironing part from the backing paper. Next, you heat up your iron, lay out your pillowcase on the wooden table, iron the pillowcase to get out any wrinkles, and then place your shirt or sweatshirt on the pillowcase and iron that too. We don't want any wrinkles, that will not look good. Once you're all ironed up, then take your cutout iron sheet, decide where you want to lay it out on your shirt, and then remove the backing. Then you very carefully place your iron-on sheet onto your shirt and place a piece of tissue paper over top, and then you iron it. And you hope you don't burn it because you didn't do a test piece like you were supposed to because you like to live on the edge. Depending on the size of the sheet, you have to iron it from like 40 seconds to two minutes and then let it cool for two to three minutes. Then you peel up the tissue paper and hope that the iron on sheet stays and it did for me. Ah, and nothing was burnt. Ah, yes. Then it's time for decorating. So I did this off camera because I was running out of time and it was also just like tedious and I was like guessing. With the felt I made like a little Santa hat and a little elf hat and then I placed them all onto Mr. Fenn's faces and then fabric glued them to the shirt. Put a bunch of books on top, let it sit for like an hour or so and then removed it and voila, we have cute cat faces wearing adorable hats. For the other sweatshirt, I wanted to do reindeer ears, and so I printed out a reindeer antler and then uh, cut it out and used it as a stencil for fabric paint so that I could draw the reindeer antler. And not freehand it, because I didn't trust myself with that. Then I let the fabric paint sit and dry, and then I added some cute little pom-poms for the kind of band around his head. Again, you have to fabric glue it and then place some books on top to seal it and let it dry. But then eventually you are left with this. Yeah, guys, yeah, it's magical, isn't it? So what do you guys think of the cute little sweaters? I love them so much. They turned out immensely better than I had imagined them to. I was like, I was really winging it with this video, and but I, they're so cute, and I love the little hats and scarves that they're wearing. Ah! Uh. <laughs> And now you guys can make your own crazy cat lady Christmas sweaters or really anything you want that you could iron on and then decorate. Your dog, your iguana, your hamster, your Aunt Muriel that just, I don't know, cause it's fun. For the question today, I wanna know what you would make an ugly Christmas sweater of. Mine obviously would be my cat, but what would you put on a sweater? Tell me down in the comments. Plus remember that you can check me out on these other social media sites. Instagram is my favorite where I will put some more photos of these adorable Christmas sweaters. <laughs> Thanks for hanging out with me today and making a crazy cat lady Christmas sweater. I hope this video made you smile and I will see you guys on Thursday. Bye. <laughs>